Unicycle basketball, it's, it's an unusual thing because playing basketball on two feet is hard enough. Doing it on unicycles is twice as hard. Doing it with 10, 11 people in one small ring is even more devastating than what you think. We have lots of fun. We know we always fooling around, playing around, getting the act here, there, and just basically having fun. 17 years ago, a brand new act joined the international cast of The Greatest Show on Earth. These athletic young men hailed from the streets of the Bronx. Jerry King started the troupe, and the tradition was carried on by his son, Charles. My dad started as a community project in the Southeast Bronx, and he used a unicycle basically as a tool to keep kids doing something constructive, and it turned into, a, I should say, an innovating street act, and became the first black act ever to appear with The Greatest Show on Earth. Now that wasn't very hard, was it? Of course I cheated a little bit. I'm not about to try it on a unicycle. It's really amazing to watch the King Charles Troop perform. It is a zany, fast-paced brand of basketball. It's also a tightly knit routine, but the guys do have a lot of fun. Well, we try to do as much clowning as possible, but it's not that much fun when we run into each other and uh, we got all these piles of unicycles on the ground and everybody's trying to pick out which bike is theirs. And that's when all the fun starts to drivel away. But we have as much fun as possible. We always find new things to do. We're not computers, so you're not going to get the pass exactly right every time. Uh, so therefore, if you don't know how to play ball and improvise, you're in trouble. Improvisation is a key word among members of the King Charles Troop, and I think you can see why. Anything can happen at any time. Always aware of their roots, team members devote a great deal of time to street life back home in the Bronx. The history of this team and with the circus and back home, everybody knows about King Charles Troop. They figured all these kids from the Bronx are really doing something for themselves and doing something for the community. So I'm, I'm real honored to be a part of the team. When the spotlight hits these one-wheeled wizards, audiences witness a zany, bizarre brand of basketball. On page 13, I'm David Elliott.